We are one human family. We are one globe. But the reality is that human families don't always get, get, don't always get along. So we look around us in the world today and we see that supposedly the economy is back but not for everyone. Jobs, homes, even voting rights at risk. Who thought we would go back on that one? It's hard to feel like one when we feel like we might be next. Or we look around us internationally. It's hard to feel like family when wars abound. Old ones that we can't resolve and new ones threatening over the horizon. Even in church, we see the divisions of the world come into church. Red pews and blue pews. What is that? So in spite of the fact that Ephesians tells us we are one already, that Genesis tells us that God created us one human family from the beginning of time, our experience says loud and clear that we are not yet one. So which is it? Unity already or not yet? Now people ask me why I talk so much about unity. I mean, people say, can't you see that there is no unity? The church is broken, the world is broken, our families are broken. And I have to admit, we are not yet where we need to be. The gift is given, but it's still, I don't know, it's still all wrapped up in the wrapping and in, in the mailing paper. It's kind of banged up in the transmission, stamps all over it. We are not yet one. The scar of racism still festers across the body of the church. The outrage of poverty still exists among us. LGBT brothers and sisters do not feel welcome, much less safe at many of our tables. We can't just pretend that these divisions and barriers don't exist. And yet, Ephesians, Genesis, story after story in the Bible tells us we are already one. Already one. God has given us a gift. A gift of unity and creation in the first place. And in case we missed it there, and the greatest gift of all, the gift of Jesus, who came to earth to reconcile us to God and to each other. What if we could just receive the gift and begin to unwrap it, to take away those outer layers of division piece by piece? What if we could, we could live now beyond the divisions and act as if we're already one?